Hi guys, Steve here. On this video I'll be playing Snow Runner. It's an off-road driving game with realistic mud, snow and water physics. We have to recover vehicles, deliver supplies and traverse treacherous terrain. That's a mouthful. You can play single player or multiplayer to up to four people and you can unlock 40 unique vehicles with upgrades and customization. I'll be taking you through the start of the game and guide you through the first few missions. And thanks to Focus Interactive for the key. I've been wanting to play this. Right, I've already had a little bit of a practice, but I'm going to go on new game. Quickly take you through the starting tutorial. So you know what to do when you start playing. Right, in Michigan. It's a devastating flood. The town's wrecked. First we need to find a watchtower to see the surrounding area. Let's press OK. Right, my handbrake is in park. Space to release, start the engine, press M to see the map, we need to go there, scroll out a little bit, track objective, alright if you press E with this vehicle you get all wheel drive, if you hold shift you can go into lower gear. Helps you get out of the sticky mud. And swamp areas. I'm going to go in automatic. That's our objective over there. Now, as you can see, this isn't a racing. This is a heavy duty off road with realistic physics for mud and snow. And it's more of a thinking person's game. Oh, slid off then. Concentrate instead of talking. Like every rock, every bit of divot of grass, every channel of mud. Right. We're there, we need to get over there go to that watchtower later and reveal the surrounding area right I'm on the road so I can switch it or we'll drive off now there's a slight delay when you turn the wheel left and right so you've got to have your wheels aligned up properly which direction you're going otherwise you'll swerve off all over the place The uh, road's blocked here. Different kind of train. Now I could go over there, but let's just go over. Sunken road. It's a little bit deep. Let's get all-wheel drive. Use more fuel if you use all-wheel drive. Well, it just so happens. Get rid of those on his barriers. Fuel station here. C and fuel up. Fuel's free. If you're working for a company. Right, we need to get over here so we can go that way or we can go that way. Let's go. That way we came, we can right mouse button and select the path you want to take. This is our starting truck. Let's turn into there. Now that looks really muddy and swampy, so what I'm going to do is got four wheel drive on, I'm going to stay on the grass. At least I have two wheels in it. One of the most realistic off road simulators. There's the watchtower. Go inside the box. Good job. Discover the first watchtower. If it was part of a map, you need to repair the bridge. Okay, let's have a look at the map. 
Alright, there's a truck over there. Discover Arch Tower. Oh, there's also upgrades and it reveals different parts like it's trailers. Lumber mill gives you wood. You've got upgrades. Yes, I've gone through the marker. If you hold down the middle mouse button you can delete them or just click on the dots to remove them. Right, find the truck. Right, it's marked with uh, magnifying glass. Let's in fact let's not cut across there, let's just go down here. Markers at the side of the screen tell you which direction. Or we'll wheel drive on. Let's make it out of there okay. There's a lumber mill ahead. Okay. Front, we've got a slight bit of damage to the engine. to get more information. Press X to show damage. It's only slight. Those darts you can put as winches. Winch points. Let's go up here. This is like a rough muddy train. Try and stay on the grass. Like that might be a bit of a problem. Stay on the more solid ground. Once you go over a train, you can actually dig it up if you get your tyres stuck. And here's our truck. We found a new highway truck. No off road options. Alright, let's enter truck. Press V, change truck. Let's click on it. Good. It's not the best truck for the job, but it'll do. Alright, take the handbrake off again. Open up map. What we need to do. Let's take a look at the old bridge. I can take a look at it with my other truck. Okay, select the mission. Right, we need to deliver metal beams and two lots of wood. Right, have we got a trailer? Yes, we have. Let's activate that. We're now ready to repair the bridge. Pick up metal beams from there. I need to deliver it there, but I'm going to take that trail. Put wood into it because we need wood as well. Right, this has got no off road options. So it's going to suck if I get it stuck in the mud. I want to get up too much of a slope because you can tip your vehicles. If the engine cuts off when it goes to the side, you can't use a winch to put it back. Oh. Something. Repair your vehicle in the garage or special service app. Let's reverse this. It's a bit muddy, isn't it? There's some wood already loaded. Right, let's use that. Put my handbrake up. Oh, that off, that's it. Put the handbrake on. 
and I'm pressing F to pull the trailer so I don't have to crawl through that mud. Trailer discovered. Get it close to the back of the truck. Loose winch. Attach trailer. Okay. Now, we have a winch spots. Damn, I can't put it onto there. If I can drive out, we're going to have to use a winch. Because we're stuck before, but it's doubly stuck now. Let's use that post. And we need to go to get some metal beams. So let's go there. Along this side to there, no, no, no. Right, press F to pull the winch. I'm also driving forward as I'm going. Try and get onto the solid ground. Release the winch. Any other close parts? Can't go to there. Let's have uh, that one. Go release winch. Oh. Let's move forward, get the momentum. muddy and it's raining. Let's try and stay on the solid ground. Keep our momentum up. We've compensating a bit. Looks a bit muddy. Keep an eye out for posts as well because you, if you get stuck you can use your winch. Like so. Alright, I'm going to put myself in low gear. Let's go winch yourself onto that. Go on baby, you can make it. That tower's stuck. That's a little tree. So if I use my winch it'll pull it out of the ground. It's way too much weight. Either side windshare. Put myself in automatic, that's better. Release the winch, go on, you can make it. I don't think the rain and mud's open. that slope. Right, I'm next to that tree. So I can use that as an anchor. I'm not going to go back to retrieve that. I'm going to pull it up with my winch. There we go, it's better. I was stuck on that corner. There's a big slope. Right, it's loads of trees now, so let's reverse slightly, attach, or release the winch and attach a trailer again. I want to show you uphill climbing. It's a big enough tree, that'll work. This is how you pull yourself uphill, up a muddy hill. Just keep using the winch. Just out of range. Got it. I can 
said this is not an off-road vehicle. I want to show you what it can do. In mud, when you don't have an off-road vehicle. Come on, baby. Keeping an eye on that post in case I need it to winch me out. Nearly on the flat. Going up that muddy hill. It's a bit of a pain. Hopefully it taught you what to do. Right, have a look around when you're driving. Because there's other trailers and stuff to find as well, and other missions. Turning here, in the town. This is a bit of narrow turning. Never drove a truck in real life. So if you're a retired trucker, you probably love this game. Alright, sea management, I've loaded metal beams you can select a truck we could select the trailer auto load that still got a wood it's got oh, oh we crushed a bin so we've got all the materials we need let's go that side down here need to repair the bridge remember and I could go over there but let's risk it over the sunken road and that's our course just missed that post if you hit anything you damage so you can't go around like a bat out of hell ramming everything affects the effectiveness of your truck Ghost town is deserted. After a huge flood. Oh, I need a fire hydrant. Just missed it. Oh! Overcompensating. So what do you know about attaching the trailer? Prepared this bridge, it'll give us access to our garage. And we can salvage trucks and trailers, get better vehicles, upgrades, colour our trucks. Let's stop in here for some fuel at the moment. There we go, top top, bottom left. Too fast. There's a tree to the left, keep an eye on that. It's quicker than going all the way around. Don't want to get caught on the mud as well because it's chucking it down the rain. As you can see, it's not GTA. It's not a racing game. You have to go steady, carefully, and think what you're going to do. Alright, cargo management. Let's unload. 
the iron beams to build the bridge. And we've got a wood. There we go. Got a new rank as well. F4 driver profile, got $2,100. Some points. My profile. You've repaired the bridge. First contract. And that's basically the tutorial done. Not too long, was it? Right. You have to get your rank up to get better vehicles. Right. Let's have a look. Gouge now appears on the map. It's over here. Roadhead won't be easy. You can switch to a different vehicle at any time. So if you click that and I can go back to my Jeep which started off with or well, my truck but let's see if we can make it with this. I'll go a bit further in for now. I'm gonna leave my small tr off road truck there. Get some upgrades. Right, which way do I need to go? Down here or across there? Hmm. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to switch to this. Starting truck. What I'm going to do is get an upgrade. Then we're going to go to the garage. Right, upgrade is up there. Four wheel drive on. Let's plan our route. So, down there. Let's go all the way across here. There, so you can scat. You're supposed to scout around with your smaller four-wheel truck, find different stuff like trailers, uh, go to the watchtowers. So you can reveal the area, and then do the big hauling with your main truck. Right, it's got day and night cycle as well. Turn the lights on. Wood. Starting truck's fairly good. bit fast. Just made it. Gotta use my winch anyway. When you have upgrades on the map, it's best to collect them. Oh, that's a bit bad. Everyone. Engine's getting damaged. When you take your truck back to the garage it automatically gets repaired plus you can use recovery on the bottom left that'll take you to the garage once you've discovered it there's a bit of water in mud hole Let's see if we can get through that at the moment no stress in Oh, 
should have done that. Let's make him work for myself. Step myself into low gear. Like real life, you want to avoid the nasty pits. at night. Try to avoid the big rocks because you can get stuck on them. Especially if it gets stuck underneath your chassis. So you've got to take your scouting trucks off-road because you'd never get your main truck up there. Compensated on the steering. Those rocks aren't helping. And they got stuck. The longer you wheel spin, the deeper you get. Oh, I must be turning. Okay, I've. Looks back there. Right, watch careful, you don't want to flip it. Should put a spot here. So, if you like cross country, it's definitely a game for you. It's more of a skill based driving game than oh crap, oh crap, I'm falling. Than a like all out speed racing one. Get up there. Uh oh. Attempted to go down it and go up. What do you think? That's not the safest path, is it? Use the trees and the winches. Hopefully, I can go up here. Use your bomb up. Just about. Try not to flip over. The wind shun. Because this truck's lighter, it won't rip a tree out of the ground. But that tree would have been fine because it's big enough. But the little ones, you can use these more than you can. The big truck, just from a weight. Almost there. Put up the free upgrades in hard to put uh, get to places. Go on to there we go. going to be. need to drive into the square. Get to upgrade, press C. Uh, suspension kit. And I can use that to upgrade a garage. You can check what vehicle you put it on. 
Right. While I'm here, I could go across there and reveal this watchtower. I think I'm going to do that. You see me go across country as it is. I'm going to skip forward until I'm there. Alright, almost made it. Give you more points. See all around us now. Let's make our way down and go to the garage. If you don't like driving in the night time, what you can do is open your map and skip time, which is a nice feature. It's gone darker. It's going daytime. <laughs> Oops. Alright, left door. I can go right. Alright, let's go and find that garage. Rescue that truck. I'm looking at the sides and a little crack. Road. Making good done, it was another watchtower. Let's go and collect that. Very swampy one. Deep up more days. And we made it to the next watchtower. Let's see what it's revealed. Let's look at a map. Trailers, farm. So I'm gonna. G Let's not go across there just yet. Oh, isn't? There's a truck. I can recover. I think. Let's pull myself out of there. Good job. I didn't move forwards anymore. Need 
need to press reverse. As you're still pulling yourself backwards. Deep mud. I need better tyres to come in this. Stuff around. So if I do get stuck in the mud, I can pull myself out. I'm gonna make it, I think. Stay away from that mud. Bring a little tree over. Hey, back on the tarmac. Ugh. Oh, it's a stuck truck there. I'll go and get that in a bit. Another trailer there. You have to get really close to it to discover it. Any more trailers? A uh, fuel tanker. Let's go down there. That'll be the right way. So four wheel drive. I'm truck's a bit knackered. Run out of fuel, but I should be able to make it there uh, fine. Farm. The road throws you all over the place. Way, way overcompensated there. Press my left mouse and uh, A button on the keyboard. On stake. The controls are very sensitive. Have to be gentle. Here we are at our garage. Trailers spinning it. Ah, uh, finally made it. Discover your first garage. Okie dokie. What's this here? Truck discovered. Get upgrade. All wheel drive. Okay. Truck looks like it's in a bit of a worse state. Could change trucks. Oh, that's knackered, isn't it? You used you need fuel whenever your engine is running. Yeah, damaged. Everything's damaged. I cannot move. Let's change trucks back. Let's drag it into the garage. 
Come on, baby. I've got so many fun to go with. Right. Now let's change trucks again. Now can I move to garage? Yes, I can. Ah, oh, sneaky. My tr truck is repaired because I took it in here. Buy and sell vehicles. Before ne moving to the next, you need to retrain. Okay. So, let's have a quick look here. So, the devs gave me a version of a game with this truck, which can go virtually everywhere because it's got awesome tyres. But I'm just going to stick to the standard stuff. Alright, train. Then it wants me to go back. Global map. Alaska. Go to that garage. This is still a bit of a tutorial area. It tells you how to change areas. Uh, truck store. Deploy. Back. Leave garage. And I've moved over to Alaska. Just like so. Let's have a little look around. So that's how you move to the different world zones. Got four there, three there, four there. I'll go back to Black River. Let's go back to the garage. In fact, I'm going to need to drive around to enter again. That's the exit. Yep, this is the entrance. Move to garage. Let's retrain that. Go global map. Go back to Michigan. Go back to the garage. Store. Oh, no. That's what I'm going to show you in a second. Here you can buy different trucks. Like that's the scout truck I started with. You get little uh, ticks when you've got a truck. When I say it tells you what to do, so it's not got all wheel drive, that's the highway truck. That one's uh, compatible with all wheel drive and diff. I'll just quickly show you all the different trucks. You need to open in standing and have loads of money for some of these. Some you can only buy in different parts of the world. That's all the trucks we've got in game, quite a few. Let's go back, truck store. Ah. Right, I picked up a upgrade. Let's go back, customize. Right, these are locked because I don't have Enough standing. That's suspension. Tyres. Now I've got 8,800. 2,000 for these. I can't unlock any of the uh, off road tyres. Winch, diff, spare wheel. So it's compatible with all-wheel drive, but it hasn't got it at the moment, but I think I can enable it. Rear-wheel drive, all-wheel drive, install. 
so now I can switch it on and off and a diff so it's kind of an off road truck then you've got the frames big crane flatbed and body maintenance side probably go for that one fuel truck small crane high saddle and low saddle all right let's leave in fact let's customize our color so that's the mechanical parts and then you can change stuff like the bumper put uh, sirens on stuff lights there's a bumper one's a bit better by saving my money horns different better exhaust change my rims let's go let's do my colour first let's do it new blitz orange ply right, let's look at rims I think these are free which ones do you think are best let's go for those the red but I might, we'll go with my orange there we go leave garage take the handbrake off truck wheel drive so it's got six so it's got two wheels there each side four at the back to the front so that should be pretty good but while we're here let's put our scouting truck in repair that and get its fuel let's change truck move to garage let's customize this let's do some paint now with uh, bonus DLC got a new paint job let's apply that sure should I do that orange as well here yeah, let's put it on it's more fancy right I picked up a suspension upgrade raised yep let's install that tires right highway no all terrain so let's do all terrain because the off roads are blocked let's go for the biggest chunky 38s right let's look at the stats oh they're better aren't they on road mud good off-road, on-road, mud. Let's go for the mud ones. Let's go buy those. Nice. Let's go back. I don't think I can move anything else. On these, you can have roof packs, more fuel, repairs, stuff like that. Put snorkel on to go through water. don't think I can do the diff yet differential locks both wheels tire suspension gears that'll be fine oh let's show you the mods miscellaneous sidebars rear bumper roof horn Beacon and fog light. Shall I have those? Yeah, it's only 300. Let's look professional. They're better bumpers, aren't they? Kind of like that one the most. I'll save money for now. Right, rims. Let's go for them. There's our vehicle. It is raised. I think 
that's most of the tutorial done. Shiny lights. Turn them on and off. Oh, it's got fog lights at the top, it's giving me more light. Right, I'll leave my vehicle there. Right, we are here. Some more trailers. So, drowned scout truck, let's do that. Right. Which way is the best way to go at it? In fact, let's go. Let's have a look from a farm. I've got mud tyres, I've got high suspension and that's all. But I've got a new paint job and some flashy lights but that doesn't really count as mods. Ready for action. drive on, it's getting a little bit muddy. way to go at it. Now, this is mostly water, that's going to be tough. Slightly narrow there. But it looks like you can go all the way from there, so... Shall I just go around that side? Yeah, it'll be quicker, won't it? Get the mouse button down. Let's go there. Try that. It's getting dark again. Let's speed up time. Uh, get a morning. down. Mind. It looks deeper than they did on the map, doesn't it? on. Keep powering through. Attempt to go to lower gear. Yeah, we are 
got our final uh, Zone. Have to enter it and accept it, okay. Let's get lined up first. Let's accept it, one thousand one hundred. It's out. It's best to go out the way we came in. Staying on higher ground. drive in. So what I'm going to do is when it gets tough I'm going to release the winch because the weight of us is too much Get on a good bit of land, put the handbrake down, connect the winch again. Now pull the truck. Now maybe you can do it. I'll be able to get my main truck out of here. But if I get stuck at all, I can just uncouple the winch, pull it towards me, and then drive off again. That's a bit of a muddy hole, isn't it? There we go. So you do it with a basic truck. Fairly easy once you get the hang of it. Oh, where do I need to drop that out? Uh, it's on this one. Drowned highway truck. Drowned scout. So I need to drop it there at the farm. Start tracking. Okay. A couple of minutes to get used to what to do there. get reward. I'm going to take it in the square. Uh, 
There we go. That was easy enough. Balance is going back up. Right, what's the next mission? I could get that drowned highway truck. Right, you've got your contracts. This is where we are. River Steel Supplies. So what do I need to do? Pick them up. Drop. Isn't that a deposit? No, it's a supply. Town storage. Okay. So I need to pick the wood up from there and drop it there. What else? Consumables. I think from there. Okay. Then a fuel oil tanker from there. This might looks like it might be a long one. Right, let's switch trucks to that's my highway one, that's my off road one. drive bad boy. Alright, I think I might... How much cargo do I need? Consumables 2 and 2. Okay, I'm going to put a flatbed on the back of this. Customise. Frame, flatbed, or that one. Mm, let's go for that one. The garage, took off handbrake, so I need to load up with consumables. Which is down there, down there, down there, down there. So I've got all wheel drive on this now, which I can turn on. So I've got six wheels. So it's getting to an off roader. And I can lock the diff as well. I think you need to go into low gear and then turn your diff on. fast. So I get some over this mod without having four wheel drive on. I've got six wheel drive on this, all wheel drive. Consumables, you got any more cargo? No, let's auto load that. Okie dokie. Right, the next stop. Let's go, shall we go to a lumber mill and risk it with this much weight? Was that hill up there? Remember how muddy that was? Um, let's try it. Let's go. Made the truck a bit heavy. Look. 
Okay, there. Uh. Turn all wheel drive off. demo, put your truck into low gear, and then you can turn diff lock on, that's how you activate that, but as soon as you put it in automatic it turns a diff lock off. Got enough fuel. truck but can I shall I connect up with that trailer yeah let's do it enough hopefully that is yep underneath me. Graphics look good, don't they? Bad load. Come back up here once I've got the wood, it seems less steep than the other side. Fuel. 
the mill. It's best if I go back that way. Uh, let's go down this side. Load her up. Alright, select trailer. Two loaded on there. I suppose I could try and get up there, but it's a bit steep. Let's go for a shallow, longer route. Heavy now. This truck's still fairly good. Handle the load. Maybe can make it bad for a starting truck. Struggling a bit. I'm going low gear if I want. Just about to level off. Damage yet. Ever pressed a button? It's very sensitive. I think you can actually place a steering wheel. Controller, it's on console. Let's do 
that were allowed in the back passage. Is that? How do I? I need to pick up lumber. So you got to activate that. Oh, you do. So you must activate it, guys. So that's consumable and the wood. Next I need to deliver that truck. Right, I don't need this trailer anymore. What's the best way to get to the broken bridges so I'm gonna have to go around truck turn the uh, oil drive off if sickness road it's gonna be a fairly long drive so I'll skip forward a bit until I get closer to it down. The pylons come down and block the road. Right, click on that one. I'm going to have to track this. One metal beam, two concrete blocks. But there's a trailer there. Hopefully that's got everything in it. back to this truck and landslides that need to be prepared. Right. So I think I'm 
and take base set. <laughs> okay, let's try a different tactic. Use the winch, touch a trailer. Possibly. Bring that on the concrete. Now, which direction do we need to go? Should be able to make that. Again. Let's get on firm ground. Over sides. Attach trailer again. Press V to bring up those options. Should be okay now. What's I actually need? Metal beams. Damn. Gotta go way up there. Right, 
<laughs> yeah, I'm definitely going to sell this truck. Useless. In fact, I may as well show you how to sell. I'm going to use the other truck, it'll be quicker. Right, what you can do is press V, recover, and you go back to your garage. Uh, let's go. Can I buy another one? So I get 32,000 for that. Let's sell it. Not going to use that one. A cool map. Use my bus truck. It doesn't automatically put your park, your truck in park. Should have activated request. Well, I couldn't really because it I just discovered it when I got down here. If I could have activated it, then I could have seen I would have got the metal beams. Only needs one metal beam, so I'm going to load two just in case I need something else. In fact, no, I'm not because I need to empty it uh, for when I go back to get a fuel truck. Cargo. Right, just loads one lot anyway. I thought that was two lots, but it looks like one. That'll be fine. Go back and get those concrete blocks. Crap, no crash. Hmm, back to the concrete blocks. Let's turn around and attach. Lock on. Switch low gear to activate on now. It's a hell of a lot of weight. All of that. It's making it though. Give the truck one to stood a chance. Off. Use the trees to tow me form. Oh, 
limit of uh, how much this truck can pull. Thousand five hundred. Rebuilt it. Let's get some more air. Oil tanker. It's not that one, is it? Let's activate it, see if it is. Finish a big, big mission. Let's deliver that fuel tanker to the main mission because I think I get more money. best I've got. Turn the map around as well. Oh, it's a bit steep in it, I might need a winch for this.
Just a like. Oh, that concentrate's getting a bit muddy. Let's go. Diff. Can I grab anything? Muddy hill is going to be a bit of a pain. That's a route to the f mission. in the soil look really good, don't they? downhill now anyway. Should make it easier. Got enough 
fuel. Some. That's where the landslide was, I think. Coming to that. Crap! Oh crap! I right, tipped the fuel tanker. Wonder if it exploded. Let's take it more carefully. And this little landslide. The electric pylon. Landslides around the other side. Right, that's the odd part done, hopefully. Oh, no? It was nearly a disaster, I kind of misclicked some of the sensitive keys. Smoke too soon on the easy part, let's avoid that rock. You guys, you've got to be careful. Think which path to take, what cargo to pick up. It's kind of like a. Oh, just kicked it. It's like a puzzle thinking driving game. You really need loads of skill. Back to delivery. his car give me the money there we go 2800 oh yeah rank 3 as well thank you very much See different quests on the map, like this one here, but you still need to go up to it. Show task and accept it to be able to do it. And then you need to make it a track mission. If you don't do that, you could like bring over cargo to a Pacific area, then not get reward and it doesn't take it in, doesn't unload it. Right. That should do for now guys. That's quite a long video. Shows you the basics of Snow Runner. It's a good game, I like it. Let me know 
in the comments below if you want me to stream this. I think I will because it's kind of nice and relaxing. Right, I am up here. If you want to go back quickly, cover vehicle. I don't know if there's any like penalty or anything. 38,000. Uh, truck storage, truck store. I could buy that one. That one's the one I sold. I could buy another one of what I've got. 40,000. Scout. Off-roader, 83. Come back and I'm repaired. Take off the park. I'm ready for the next mission. Let me know in the comments if you want to see us guys. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed this video please like and subscribe and click the bell icon to get notified of when I upload next. There's links to my other videos at the end. Thank you for watching and hopefully I'll see you again. Goodbye.